Happy New Year and welcome to Rolling with Renee. What's up guys? It is January the 1st, 2022. We made it y'all. We made it another year. So you know what that means. We out here, we busy. We collecting our coins. We ain't dimming our light. We gonna blind everybody. Doesn't matter how they feel. We ain't dimming no lights this year. We gonna make sure that we are accomplishing everything we set out to do. Shout out to my Michigan people. <laughs> Georgia Bulldog put a whooping on no Wolverines. Yes, baby. Roll Tide, we coming up. Back again, we coming for you. But this ain't even about football. Let me just say, we back in these Walmart streets. If you're new to my channel, welcome. If you are already subscribed, thank you so much for rolling with with me throughout the year uh this channel right here is pretty much for entrepreneurs you know i'm gonna be showing you a lot of different things that i do this is basically just rolling with renee through the life and and just you know we just out here in these streets so today what i'm doing is sitting here at walmart because i'm waiting on one of the employees to come out to load me up so that we can deliver this customer's grocery who has placed a walmart order online so if you weren't familiar with this what spark delivery is all about or what i'm talking about about then there you have it this is what we do this is what i do i'm out here delivering groceries you can sign up and join as well the link is down in the description below if you haven't already subscribed and like what you see so far go ahead and hit that subscribe button and make sure that you turn on the notification bell because in 2022 you don't want to miss nothing that i upload okay so anyway um we're waiting on the order y'all know how this goes and this is my first one of the year this is a batch order and we just gonna see how this goes they have they're running this little um what they call it they run in this little um, bonus program today where you do eight deliveries or something like that it's an additional $25 so uh, I'm trying to I'm gonna try to get that but your girl is sleep like I was on one of my other side hustles I'm gonna tell y'all all about that all of that is gonna be coming up in the channel so y'all gonna have to make sure y'all are staying tuned yeah. so I am still at Walmart and I am waiting still um I guess it's gonna be like a slow this is gonna it's not even that busy so I don't know maybe people just did not come to work for 2022 I don't know but I am still waiting I know that I have a quite a few people that come in a lot that say that you know they prefer to do the shopping and delivery because this is a waste of time to sit in the parking lot and just wait but yeah it is it is i'm not even gonna lie it's a waste of time but in 2022 i said i'm gonna try and practice a little patience a little more patience because i i have a a little bit this much i have this i'm gonna practice a little bit more patience because i know that you know we got this new monster run around here um this new variant and so they just may be short staffed once again um but that gives me time to record so it really doesn't bother me as much but because like i said it gives me time to record so while i'm sitting here i guess i can just i don't even know what i want to talk about today because my whole goal was to just start the video off and um we just get these deliveries in and try to and try to get this bonus but i don't know what y'all want to talk about so i know that i know what i can talk about because i see a lot of this uh, going on now uh, let's just talk a little bit about the cons of spark well, just in case you're new and you're still trying to get on or you're you're trying to figure out if this is something that you want to do let's just talk about a little bit about cons so one of the cons that i see that a lot of people have is just like i said the waiting waiting on an order when you're at the store after um, Walmart has sent, well, Spark has sent you the notification saying that the order is ready. Um, there are times that it's going to be kind of slow. So, like I just said, if you don't have a whole lot of patience, then, you know, this is probably something that you want to reconsider if you're used to, you know, running in and picking up stuff. Um, now, there is a, a pro to that because Walmart um, does offer the shopping and delivery just like how instacart is so that's kind of like that counterbalance of the no waiting versus going inside the store to actually shop for the groceries so i don't know how busy your area is my area i'm in georgia um, my area is not that busy for the shopping and deliveries i haven't seen a lot of those in my area but some other areas I, I'm, I'm assuming that they are um extremely busy with that part so you know depending on your area you may only get the curbside pickups uh, versus the shopping and deliveries now i will say the con to the curbside deliveries is sometimes you'll have like uh big orders batch orders and you may not seem it may not seem to you like 
it's worth the pickup because you have two orders and then they're only paying you uh, $19 or something like that or it might not even be that much sometimes it's even lower but um, the shopping and delivery does offer you a little bit more money and then you know most of the times it's not even large large orders that you have to shop for and then you know you can go ahead on the time that you would wait to sit here to wait on the order and then to have to come you know to wait on the order and then you got to deliver both of them the time that you would wait to do that versus the shopping and delivery then that is what i'm saying about the the counter it kind of counterbalances that because there is another way that you can make some money with spark it's just you have to wait to get that type of notification um, as far as waiting period to get on to the to the app when you are just signing up there is a wait list so if you're trying to get on and you're having a little bit of trouble getting on because it may just be so many drivers out here then that's another con that I'm seeing that a lot of people are saying that um, they can't get approved or they they can't get um, accepted onto the onto the app so that's just another thing only thing I can say to that is if you are into doing a lot of different um, apps as they call it app gigging if you're into doing that I would just say log into those different apps you know try to log into as many as you can and work those until you know your time comes for you to get out here and do spark um, as far as another con, uh, a lot of people do complain about the app not working or it's slow. I don't have that issue, so I can only say that it's just like with anything else. It's just like with your phone. You may have to update it. You may have to update your app. You may have to turn your phone completely off uh, and re-download the app. You know, it, it's just, you just have to know how to troubleshoot. It's no different than if your internet went out at your home what are you gonna do you know you know what I'm saying so that's just another a con that a lot of people do talk about like I said I don't have that issue um, as far as tips I'm not even gonna get into that because whew, all I can say is just go check out my tip uh, click tip baiting video if you're wondering about tips because some areas are out here showing out some areas are doing exactly what they're supposed to be doing so i'm not going to get directly into that if you want to know about the tips and all of that other stuff i have i think two or three videos and i'm just going to link them down below so that you can check those out um and that is also a con a lot of the pro uh, I, i'm not a con it's a pro a lot of the cons they have pros to go along with it so i love the fact that the pay is weekly it's every Tuesday now let me just say with the pay I don't know what time um, spark or DDI put your money into your account it just depends sometimes you may get it as early as 1 p.m. it may come in at 3 p.m. it may come in at 5 p.m. but you can bet that it's gonna come on Tuesday you just have to wait on it and uh, that's a, also another con that a lot of people have because they don't want to download another app to be able to get their money now con of that is I mean the pro to that is you get paid weekly but the con is you have to download another app and you know get everything all set up so that they can send your direct deposit to you so that's that's something that you would need to think about too you know if you're not interested in trying to be all over the world to try to figure out where your money is and it's really not hard i also have a video on that as well so if you want to check that out i'll leave that either up here in the in the cards or it'll be uh, linked down in the description below but overall i mean the the pros for me outweigh the cons um i love the bonuses the bonus opportunities that they give um all the time it's always a bonus going on um i love like i said the flexibility of working when you want to um it is i meet a lot of people so i love the networking part of it i network a lot while i'm out yeah i just thought that i would just say that a little bit because it's 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 you have to you have to see for yourself what is what works best for you and that's a lot that's that's the one thing that I do want to say a lot on my channel this year you know what works for you 
may not work for the next person and vice versa. And I get a lot of inboxes or sometimes I get some messages where people feel like others are lying about their success with this because they're having so much trouble with it. Sometimes you just got to realize that some things just aren't for you. You know, some people may be a little bit more tech savvy. Uh, some people may be a little bit more patient. Some people may have just that whatever it takes to just get the job done. I don't know because I know some people that do make a thousand dollars a week uh, and more. And I see sometimes in my comments where a lot of people are saying that these people are lying because they don't feel like they they are making that because they haven't been able to make that money. But you can't say that. And you can't say what somebody else is making and you can't base what somebody is what what somebody else is making based on your area. Their area may be very, very much booming. And you may be in a rural area where you got one Walmart. So no, you probably won't be able to make as much money, but you'll be able to make some money. You got some people that make as less as like a hundred dollars a day. But if you look, or probably $50 a day, but if you look at that over time, you know what I'm saying? You have to, I don't know, I guess you have to have some analytics skills as well so that you will be able to, you know, to see what, what is going to work for you and is it, is it worth doing it? Because to me, it is worth it because I, let me just say this. I, I say that it's worth it for me because I don't do this all the time. This is just my side hustle. It's just that it's a side hustle, but it's a lucrative side hustle for me because I know what I want to get out of it. I'm not looking for no more than what I want to get out of it. When I have my uh, supporters that send me stuff and they show me their uh, their earnings tab and all of that, I'd be like, dang, you know, I need to get on it like they're on it. But I know that that's not going to work for me. I'm not, I don't want to make $1,000 a week. I would love to. I mean, I ain't saying that I don't want to, want to, but I just know that right now, no, that's not going to work for me. So seeing what somebody else is doing, yeah, it may be all peaches and cream and it may be like, oh, you know what? I'm going to jump on that too. I'm going to do that too. And then when you don't get the results that you're looking for, then it's a scam or, oh, they, they doing this or you know what I'm saying? Or they lying about their, their income. I mean, you can't say that. You can only speak for your experience. And like I said, I, when I'm speaking, I'm only speaking from mine and I'm not in the market to make a thousand dollars a week from spark. I'm just not, um, sometimes it has happened now. It has happened, but that was in 2020 when we all went through C19, when it all first started and it, I wasn't even working that much, it, but it was just people that were just so grateful to be able to get what they needed without having to leave their home. So they will co felt compelled to give more back then. And so, you know, we're coming back. It seems like we're coming back full circle with the same thing. So, you know, sometimes you just have, that's why I say, sometimes you have to just be a little patient with the app and see if this is something that you want to do, because every day is not going to be great. You're going to have some very slow days. You're going to have some days where you just be out here just bumping like, you know, it's a lot going on. But on those slow days, then that's when you have to have another plan to say like, what is it that you... What else, is, what else is it that you can do to help push, you know, the, the slow days along? In my case, I have a small business where I, you know, I, I, I sell merchandise. I sell products on the side. But I, it's my small business. It's established. And that's why I say I only do a few hours here and there. I don't work every single day here on this app. I don't, I don't do no more than three hours most of the time. I do not work in the afternoons. I don't work past two o'clock. Like, uh, well, sometimes not even, I don't work past one o'clock. It's just certain things that I'm willing to, I'm not willing to do. Somebody else is. And you just have to take that into consideration when you're trying to figure out if this is something that you want to do. Because every day is not going to be great. Every day is not going to be like somebody else's experience. It's not. So you have to form your own opinion of 
what's going on as opposed to just saying well it looks easy for them or they said that they do it like this so i'm gonna go out here and do it like this well your area might not be so respond responsive to the way that things are they just want what they want and they could care less about your livelihood so you have to take all of that in consideration and then um, as far as safety, you know, a lot of people are taking a lot of orders, like everything that comes their way, they are taking it. And I'm assuming that's probably how some of them are um, making a thousand dollars a week. I don't know. I haven't even I don't even ask people well, how you're able to do that because I'm not interested in doing it. <laughs> I'm not. If they want to share that with me, then all great. But no, I, I say so many times that my safety comes before anything. And I'm not going to take every order that comes my way at all. I don't care what it is. And if they decide that, you know, we have to, then that'll be the end of me for Spark because I'm not going to do it. And you shouldn't either if you don't feel safe doing it. All right, y'all. So uh, the employee just came out to let me know that she was the only one that one person was actually working in this Walmart today. And... Um, I had been here I, when I first started my video I told y'all it was like 8 o'clock it is now like 9 something I don't have a problem with waiting because I did get most of my video recorded but just to let y'all know that today okay this thing let me not put the seat on okay I am um it's probably gonna be a log out day for me you know I'm just gonna go home and um I'll probably just edit up some videos that I already have um just ended up some videos that I already have it seemed like it's gonna be a bust on today and this is another thing that I was saying like some days it's gonna be good some days it's gonna be bad if they start sending out some shopping and deliveries then I probably will um, accept some of those but for right now your girl is about to go home and catch a probably another hour or two of sleep or something because I really need to wake up I really need to give me some 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 coffee in my life you know so I can whew, so I can spruce up but anyway um if I don't come back on I'm gonna holla at y'all we tried on January the 1st but you know they weren't trying to work the lady told me that nobody came to work she came to work at seven o'clock they didn't have a five o'clock person they didn't have a six o'clock person she came at seven and she's been the only one in there chick looked like she was tired already and and i that was my first time seeing her so i don't know and i pick her from that store quite often like a lot i pick that's one of my favorite stores so i'm just appalled that all my peeps just didn't come to work today y'all got me out here up here wanting to pick up groceries at on the first of the year and this is how y'all gonna do but anyway, I understand, you know, I understand some people just saying, you know, forget this. 2022 is a change. And I guess the change was they wouldn't come to work today. But anyway, I tried. Um, I hope that y'all enjoy the rest of your day. Like I said, if I don't come back on, then that's it for the day. And I'm out.